and so they like doused the uh, sauce on it. It's just absolutely covered. The, there's pickles, there's coleslaw on here. 12 seconds later. Uh, we are. Oh man, ooh, that is hot. Ooh, yeah, that was really kicking up. Ooh. Hey everyone, Joel Answer. Today we're in downtown Everett, Washington, guys. Everett, Washington, just north of Seattle, at a place called That Chicken Place. Just That Chicken Place. They have this big kind of blow up chicken in front of which is really loud, so I'll come just up the street. So here we are to do their Hell's Chicken Kitchen. No, Hell's, ha, blah, blah, blah. The Hell's Chicken Sandwich Challenge. There you go. Hell's Chicken, the Hell's Chicken Sandwich Challenge. There you go. Five, third time's a charm. Um, basically, this is a Nashville hot kind of rendition of their sandwich. So basically, this is an incredibly spicy sandwich. This is the Hell's version of their traditional Nashville hot chicken sandwich. So the Nashville hot chicken sandwich on the menu, but it's a little different. It's almost like a bit of like a mole spicy sauce. It's pretty cool. So it's not like an oil dredge and then a powder. All that is already kind of mixed up. Super thick, super sludgy. Um, that has a variety of peppers, sugars, all that good stuff in it. But then what makes it the Hell's chicken sandwich. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time saying that. Hell's Chicken, not Hell's Kitchen, um, chicken sandwich, is the addition of Carolina Reaper peppers and ghost peppers um, in the actual sandwich itself uh, and on the sauce and everything. So pretty crazy. Um, it is a $15 sandwich free in a t-shirt if we can complete it. Um, I think that's the majority of the details. And I don't know if there's a time limit, but I better find that out. But yeah, a very spicy chicken sandwich. Um, but looking forward to you know trying this out. It also have a like a Mexican Hispanic influence here, so there's like some tacos and tortilla soups on the menu. I love soups and tortilla soups, are awesome. So if you've never had it, I'm gonna have to get. I'm I'll, I'll probably get a couple items to try just before I start um, because you can't really eat spicy foods on an empty stomach. I'm an empty stomach right now. Um, but yeah, guys, should be fun. So let's go have some fun, eat some food. And uh, yeah, Hell's Chicken Sandwich Challenge. Let's go, have some fun, and let's go eat. Wish me luck, because this could be interesting. I don't know guys, Reapers and Ghost Peppers. I haven't eaten anything real spicy in a long time. So, whew, let's go. everybody so I made it in and I basically just made friends with the owner in it uh, here his name is Alfonso and I actually totally ended up with pretty much the whole menu not intentional but the way he was describing everything and there's so much passion in the food like in the, the, the and his father and mother are here and the way his father described it is they're like Alfonso taught and what he's bringing to the restaurant is make the food as if it's for your family and so I'm sorry, but because of that, I have pretty much your whole menu. Thank you. That being said, um, I could introduce it, but with the passion you had, how about you introduce it? First, of course, we have some lovely grilled chicken tacos. Grilled chicken tacos, um, chicken breast, uh, only white meat on it. We got your cilantro and your onions, just like as your street tacos, but we also have our homemade salsa, salsa taco. Okay, uh, looks good. It's, like, so, it's kind of yellowy. Yes. I look forward to trying it. And I know you mentioned some chicken breast, it's grilled, and then the, it's, it is marinated, right? Marinated at least 24 hours uh, on it so we can get all the flavors and everything that goes in. We want, we're serving everything as you see to everyone as we're gonna be uh, the ones eating it. So okay. 
go ahead. Yeah. We'll so go then, from there. So obviously we have these giant we, chicken tenders. Chicken, our chicken tenders. These are massive. Yes. So you said you take a full chicken breast and just cut it into three. Cut it into three pieces. There yeah, you go. That's how heavy they are. Fell down. So chicken tenders, house made looking like uh, crinkle fries. Only fur, fries. Press fries? Yes. Ooh, a little seasoning on them? Correct. Yep. A uh, uh, house seasoning too that we uh, created okay. and, and made it innovative here here at that chicken place. And it's a buttermilk fried chicken, right? Buttermilk fried chicken. So what, what about our wings here? What do we got happening? So they're the jumbo wings, not the not the the small ones, but we like to. As you can see, everything is huge around here. Definitely. Uh, you got them dry, um, and the reason why is you're gonna try one of our uh, yeah ten homemade sauces. Yeah, not that we one of them. We're gonna try many. So they yes. make ten. They have ten different sauces on the menu, all homemade, which is crazy. Uh, but we'll go through that in just a moment. Uh, but yeah, so lovely looking a uh, jumbo wing here, fried of course. The only chicken is coming in fresh, you said? Yes, correct. So, so it's, never frozen? It's not frozen. It's from a local company here in Makutio and Renton. That's, this is our house salad. Mm -hmm. It comes on a, on, on a bed of our uh, fresh greens. They are the mixed greens with, of course, our grilled chicken on top of it. But not, not only that, it comes with um, fresh strawberries, dry cranberries, and almonds, along with our house um, dressing, which is the, a peach poppy seed dressing, which is amazing as well. Sounds good to me. Next, tortilla soup. A roll of a tortilla soup. How we cook our chicken, again, our fresh chicken, and it comes with pico de gallo, um, fresh tortilla chips that we make here as well, and it also comes with cheese. Cheese, yeah, and yes. I got it without cheese. What I'll say, the, the smell of that broth, they like boiled it, made the order, was absolutely delicious. And the pickle of of course. Hey man, I yes. look forward to trying it. Let's say I love all these items. Now real quick, what sauces do we have here, my man? So this right here, it's our honey mustard. Okay. Uh, jalapeno peach. Yeah. This is our Nashville sauce, which okay. is our spiciest sauce. We have the Korean um, style barbecue sauce. Tequila lime. Okay. Buffalo. Spicy peanut. Mango Venero, of course, our pico de gallo, yeah. and some ketchup. Yeah, and some ketchup yes, for fries. Exactly. Hey, well, I look forward to trying all these out. Uh, before we go into the sandwich from hell, the hell's ch chicken <laughs> sandwich. So, yes. yeah, at that, we'll try this a little real, real quick. Thank you for walking me through all that. Of course. And uh, that, guys, see what it's all about. All right, everybody, so where we're going to start, obviously, we have to start with the kids, the for the kids, the vegetables. So this looks delicious guys, this chicken salad, this grilled chicken looks great. Again, cranberries, uh, strawberries as well, so you get all the health. Let me grab a little bit of everything on here. Try it just as is with that chicken, get that little flavor. Oh, listen guys, I don't know how else to describe this, but that chicken, it just like has that lovely grilled Mexican taste. It's almost like the, there's some kind of a paste, like in some flavor. There's this red paste in Mexican cuisine, and it tastes like that, and it is lovely. Strawberries with the sweetness. I'm gonna try some of these salsas. Try a little bit of the uh, jalapeno peach, which looks really good. Mmm. Oh my. Oh my god. All right, listen everybody. The jalapeno shines through on that. Just a little bit of sweetness. This is too good. All right. All that Korean sauce. All right. I did not expect even the salad to be that good. Mmm. Mango habanero, natural. Ooh, yeah, I got a little, I got a little heat to it. All right. Anyway, let's try everything else out. We got some lovely carrots and celery sticks here. Lovely portion. For the kids, and the tacos in play. Lovely looking corn tortilla, grilled marinated chicken. I love, lovely love, cilantro and onions. Some people don't, but this is like the traditional Mexican way to have a taco. Let me know if you like cilantro down below. That's a controversial one. Let's try this, uh, yeah, try this salsa. Oh, interesting. You know what? It's very, very, very mild. It's essentially just a little bit of a... Mm. 
Mmm. Full entree on your job, buddy. And how about some pico? I'm just gonna... Fresh tomatoes, cilantro, onions. Mm. Hold on, let me just like do this. Mm. Woo wee! Mm. So the sauce is very, very, very mild. Um, but I love I have the addition of this little jalapeno bit. Mm. So the yeah, this would be good for all palates. Not spicy or anything. I'm definitely a fan. The tacos are great. Let's try a French fry. Why not? It's got their house made french fries and normally I wouldn't get french fries or order french fries but hey they gave them to me so I gotta try them try one just as is mm. yeah there's a little sweetness from that salt mm. a little bit of ketchup just a lovely and it's, it's a really good french fry huh it was really good Simple, tried, and true. Slightly tortilla soup mix. So, another tortilla soup, this is a Mexican dish. So it's like lots of lovely chicken, the tortilla chips, and that broth. It's, oh yeah, like, I wish you guys could smell this. Smell of vision should be a thing, because the way they were, when they're cooking it, I just smell it boiling. Let's see, give it a shot, everybody. Oh man, everyone. You got a little bit of richness from the tortilla chips. That chicken is straight fire. The beak of the guy on there. Give you a little bit of texture. Heck yeah. And there's a lot of nice pieces in it. Very good. I'm gonna try a little, maybe one of these sauces. I think this is a buffalo one. Mmm. Oh man. What's a good buffalo? Try a little bit of this uh, jalapeno here too. I just love all the flavors of it. Mm. Yes. Try the uh, mango habanero. That's so sweet. Mm. And great broth. It's just very like comforting. Let's try a wing next. Grabbing these bad boys right here. What to try it in? Well, I haven't tried the peanut sauce yet. So we're trying their peanut sauce. So this is super, super, super thick. It smells peanutty like peanut butter for sure. Mmm. Okay. It's kind of like a Thai peanut sauce. Yummy. Try this Korean. This is a really nice, sweet, kind of little spicy one. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with like a gochujang kind. This is the tequila lime sauce. Mm. Ooh, it's kind of like a sweet hoisin. It's a lovely uh, lime zest. And those wings actually taste, it sounds funny but it tastes really fresh. Like, it's a very nice tasting wing. Try this honey mustard sauce. So they actually make this honey mustard sauce to order, uh, which is kind of, I don't know what it's like then. I've never had a honey mustard sauce made to order. Oh wow, that is a real honey mustard. Sweet, savory, and then um, the uh, jalapeno peach here, which I love. So delicious. Mm. Buffalo. That is a great buffalo sauce. I think my favorite sauces, guys, out of this, and I'm like, all right, I'm not gonna pick. It's all very good. Try these massive chicken tenders out. These are like seriously, impressively large, like big fat things, but look forward to trying it, guys. So give me some buttermilk chicken. I'll try it just by itself first. Great tasting, tasting batter. The chicken is very soft and moist. I know this is the same um, kind of like chicken that they'll use in the great big sandwiches, which you got to see the size of this chicken sandwich is massive. But I gotta say, I'm absolutely in love with this gochujang sauce or this Korean one. This buffalo is amazing. This jalapeno one I could eat by the spoon call. This, uh, I'm gonna have another really good too. With that, we have a little bit of food in our stomach. So I would say, uh, we got rock and roll. We'll head over to our spice chicken sandwich here. That's gonna be interesting.
All right, everybody, so here we are with the Hell's Kitchen. No, Hell's Chicken. I keep Hell's saying chicken. Hell's Chicken Sandwich, guys. So this is kind of hard for you to tell, but this thing is so big. And so they like doused the uh, sauce on it. It's just absolutely covered. The, there's pickles, there is coleslaw on here as well. They make that all here. Then a whole bunch of their powder. And again, so this is pure powder of Carolina Reapers, ghost peppers. There's other, um, in the, like the base shake, there's a lot of other seasonings and flavors. Same with that buttermilk fried chicken. This chicken breast on here, I didn't realize, like, listen, I saw this, like, it's hard to tell, but this bun, this is six inches. Like, this is a, this is a massive, massive, massive bun. This is way bigger than, like, any sort of standard chicken sandwich bun I've ever seen. I didn't really even know you could buy buns this big. Like, it's, it's kind of... Special order. Yeah, really? Yeah. Yeah, they're called monster buns for a reason. And then, um, what else is crazy with this thing is the chicken breast on here. This thing weighs a pound. This is like a literal pound chicken breast. It's a full, big, fat chicken breast. They just filleted, fried, and here we go. So, this is actually a lot of food. Um, there is a time limit. It is five minutes, and then we do have to wait five minutes afterwards with no drinks. So, five minutes to eat the sandwich, five minutes after burn, no drinks, and then we get the uh, sandwich for free and a free t-shirt, and the cost is 30 bucks. There you go. So Regular one is 15. Uh, regular yeah. regulars, 15. This is the, the sandwich from hell. Yeah. It's our chi Hell's Chicken Hell's Sandwich chicken is 30 sandwich. bucks. There you go. Glad I clarified. I right, will enjoy my last beverage here, and uh, we're gonna start here just momentarily. Good if I get started, my friend. Go ahead. All right, everybody, here we go. I'm, uh, I'm a little scared. There's so much sauce on this. Like, it's just literally puddled and pooled. I don't know, it's, I don't think it'd be that easy for you guys to really see it there, but this thing just, I mean, it looks deathly. The spiciest chicken sandwich I have done in a long time. And it, holy jump, dude, this is huge. Oh my God. Like, I know they said the chicken breast was a pound plus, but this thing is literally a pound plus. Man, all the pickles and sauce, this is heavy. Wow. And this is a standard size. Yeah. Guys, the value you get here is insane. This is worth, wait, this is, the normal one's 15 bucks? Yep. This is worth like at least 25, 30 bucks. Man, that's insane. Wish us luck, everybody. Let's see how this chicken, Hell's Chicken Sandwich, why do I have such a hard time saying that? Um, is what it's all about. So, be with me, dear Lord Jesus. All right, five minutes. Five, four, three, two, one. Right. Let us go. Okay. Yep. Woo, all right, so, um, mm. <laughs> first flavor is a little bit of Nashville. Or is sweet and spicy and pretty, pretty, blah, 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 pretty dang spicy. A little bit of coleslaw in there. And pickle. Is it? Is it? What? Is it a? Woo! Is it a bread and butter pickle? Yeah, it's sweet. I gotta get the, a little bit of cinnamon or something like that. Dude, this is massive. Whew, that is hot. Oh man. Yeah, that powder. Whew. That powder is definitely building now, that's for sure. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Oh wow. Oh. Whoo. Yeah, that just kicked up. Uh, it was better than normal Nashville. Whoo. I just lost my shoes, guys. Whoo. That powder. Whoo. Oh yeah. That has a bit of a kick to it. Whoo. Wee. Uh, 
not man. Yeah, I mentioned how big this freaking sandwich was. Huh. I think it should have ended by now. Oh man. Ah. Whew. Oh man. Uh -huh. Oh man. Alright. Oh guys, look. Ah. We got. Oh man, Ooh, that is hot. Ooh. Yeah, now it's really kicking up. Ooh. Man, I don't just got a mouthful of powder. But... Ugh. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh man. Oh man, who we? Ah. Yeah, man, that's just hot. Woo. I see why it's called the. Woo. The hell chicken. Hell chicken, yeah. Woo. Yeah. Ooh, what's that? 345? 345. Ah, no, five minutes, guys. Whew. Ah, five minutes. Ah, this is going to be hard. This is, uh, man, that stuff is just building. I don't know if I just had a ooh, clump of the powder at the end or just the build, but oh, man. Ooh. It has a nice flavor, though. Like, whew, that's one thing I'll. I'll, I'll uh, yeah, I could. I really might. Uh, five minutes, guys. That's what. Uh, this is the hard part. Woo. I could really use a drink right now. But, um. Oh, man. Woo. Give me a second. I'm going to try to piece my words together. I guess I'll go and put this aside or I'll get these gloves off so I don't touch my face. That'll not be good. I'm grab a napkin. Uh, okay, so, uh, whew. yeah, burning the stomach. Whew, my mouth is burning. Oh, that's for sure. My face is burning. Man. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, okay, hold on. Oh, excuse me. Whew, oh, spicy. Oh, spicy. Comment to the chef. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so that's very hot. Um, dude, that thing's huge. Yeah. What a big chicken sandwich. Are you good? That's, like, that's normal? Man, that is so big, guys. Such a big chicken sandwich. This is amazing. Like, the value of that. So worth it. 15 bucks? Yeah. Man, you get your protein for a day in one sandwich. And it's really good. And it also comes with potato tops or homemade fries. It comes with fries. Yeah. Oh, my gosh, guys. 15 bucks. That's a good deal. But the, uh... Ah, but I like the uh, the batter. Mm -hmm. In my first couple bites, I really taste that because it's like uh, similar to the chicken tenders. Correct. Right. It's very good. The uh, chicken was nice and soft. It was cooked well. Mar Mar Marinade, whatever does that. The uh, the natural hot. I do like the flavor. It's um. Is there cinnamon in it? No. Mm -hmm. So it must be from the the bread and butter pickles. But there's like a, a little bit of sweetness in there with the spice. It's definitely like oil based. I can yeah. tell it's like uh, that heat just it builds and it sticks to you. It sticks, that's for sure. But yeah, the sauce is sticky, but it's nice and sweet. There's uh, and uh, man, that's spicy. Uh, but the uh, whew, yeah, that was right here. Oof, still got some tums, some pepper <laughs> or something now. But uh, the uh, we call it the uh, uh, I don't know, guys. I don't know what I was saying. I'm a little lost right now. But uh, it's very big. Oh, at least the flavor. The flavor was, you know, the thing is, it wasn't just straight Reaper and Pep and, and Ghost. Like, it actually tasted, before I really, really started burning, it tasted really good. Actually, not my why. It, it never tasted bad. I just could kind of less taste, I was less focused on the flavor and more on just trying to eat it. But 
It's just really nice flavor. I really like that. And that's the like natural, which I tried actually. So yeah, I like that. So thank you. I think that is a standard sandwich would be absolutely delicious. This is a spicy sandwich, still very delicious, but maybe a little more painful, you know? Sometimes the food does hurt you a little bit. <laughs> yeah, definitely. But, uh, we got what? I think uh, maybe 1.15. One more minute. One more minute? Yeah. Well, one more minute, guys. But uh, yeah, very good. Um, everything really on the menu is great. Thank you. The, fantastic. Um, everything with the chicken, the very basic tortilla soup, the uh, but it was really, actually, I think impressive. What stood out to me for a while. Besides, like your, uh, oh, the 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 jalapeno, the, the jalapeno peach sauce, I really liked. You said it's just jalapenos and peaches? That's it, man. That is, yeah. well, whatever. It's so, it's, it's so good. It's so good. Whatever you do, but I love their sauces. They make them here, which, all of them, which is insane. It was very, very good. I really enjoyed that. The what stood out to me is the wings. And the tenders, just how good they were. And then, uh, that, like I said, for a spicy chicken sandwich, that's definitely one of the better tasting spicy chicken sandwiches I've ever done. Like spicy chicken challenge sandwich, because normally they have the, the heat in there, which this one had, it really just kind of tastes like not good. So, but that one is very, very enjoyable. I think it'd be really good with, uh, you know, a nice casual meal. All right, we can drink now. It's done. <laughs> Woo! Tapa Chico, the lime one, save me. Uh, all right, maybe the carbonation was not the best idea. That kind of burns the mouth still, but definitely a little nicer. But ooh, wow, yeah, I got some heat, man. Oh, yeah. I got some heat out, Hong Zhou. But uh, without everyone, he shakes over here at the chicken, that chicken place. That chicken place is awesome. I would definitely recommend Everett come on by. This is super cool. Very good food. And I think what just which, which to me what stands out is the quality you guys have. Thank you. Like, so you care about the food. And the portion sizes, they're yes. so big. It's crazy, it really is crazy. But not everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'm gonna need some Tom's or Pepto or something there. I can tell this is gonna be a little bit of a, woo, I'm gonna feel that one, but morning, hopefully. Hope not too bad. But uh, that one comes next to the Happy Happy Eating. Until the check with that chicken place. And uh, until next time. Oh, I guess we have the, we have the meal free and the t shirt, right? Correct. I'll yeah. Get, I'll get back and show you it's a t shirt, but until guy, next time, everybody. Oh. I'll show you a t-shirt that I'll say goodbye, so just one moment. But, uh, I like it. It's with the logo on it. That chicken place. Well, that chicken place got some good chicken. Thank you. And they know how to spice it up, guys. But yeah, guys, seriously, really good place. Everett, definitely a, uh, a cool little spot. This area is really neat, right downtown. And it's crust. Man, that's hot. <laughs> It's across from the center? What, what, uh, what? It's the Angels of the Wings Arena. The Angels of the Wings yep, Arena? Yeah, down to Never in Washington. Okay, and that's what, what do they do there? That's like a... All kinds of events, but the main thing, it's, uh, it's, the, it's the home of the Everett Silver Tips, the okay. hockey game. So hockey, yep. and it's, um, they, have to do, they do concerts there, right? They do concerts, uh, Ice Cube is coming up. Ice Cube, huh? Yeah. Hey, yeah. But yeah, they have, uh, like I said, this little area looks really cool too. Like, I guess this is downtown. This is downtown, right? yeah, so. the historical downtown. Crazy, well. Definitely worth a trip downtown. Definitely check it out. But uh, yeah, I've done enough talking. I've done way more than enough eating. So uh, then everyone, until next time, say happy you're happy eating. Again, thanks everybody here. Bye. Have a good day. Hi everybody, the time has come. Not for me to shave my head, for you to subscribe. So click my face right here, subscribe, click one of these two videos I picked just for you. And exciting news, we also have a new channel. So if you wanna watch challenges, raw, uncut, so you get to hear what the audience says, hear my real thoughts, opinions, noises, etc. link down below, Joel Hanson Raw. So check that out, appreciate y'all. Until next time, well, I'll see you in a minute. Click on these videos.